Throughout the challenges posed by COVID-19, stories of success reflected the power and enduring resilience of communities across Asia and the Pacific. The Japan Fund for Prosperous and Resilient Asia and the Pacific supported the Asian Development Bank's technical assistance, mitigating the impact of COVID-19 through community-led interventions, which funded five civil society organizations to respond to the crisis and build the long-term resilience of communities across five countries. Hygiene was a critical component of the response provided by ADP and JFPR. In the Cook Islands, hand-washing units and hygiene stations were installed, along with the distribution of disinfectants and PPEs, highlighting the importance of COVID-19 prevention, even in isolated regions. In Lao PDR, community volunteers were trained to build portable hand-washing units, empowering them to promote health and hygiene within their communities. Information campaigns also played a crucial role in prevention. Mongolia used animated characters to convey critical information. In Armenia, town halls, webinars, Pecha Kucha nights, and social media-based chatbots disseminated critical information. In Lao PDR and the Philippines, health volunteers and local leaders were trained to lead information campaigns to enhance COVID-19 response and ensure preparedness for future health crises. The program prioritized social protection mechanisms for Asia and the Pacific's most vulnerable. In Mongolia, essential supplies supported elderly and homeless families. In Armenia, online summer camps and bridging programs ensured education continuity for vulnerable children. In the Philippines, CSOs distributed food packs and conducted mental health training to address pandemic impacts. Amid job losses, the project assisted those affected by the pandemic, ensuring long-term sustainability. In Lao PDR, returned migrant workers were trained on alternative livelihood and skills. They also organized farmers clubs who were trained in diverse farming techniques to enhance food security and economic stability. In Armenia, the Reboot series supported startup businesses with training, mentoring, and supplies. In Mongolia, individuals gain skills and resources for various livelihoods. JFPR and ADB's intervention achieved remarkable results, bolstering the resilience of communities across Asia and the Pacific, particularly benefiting the poor and vulnerable. These stories highlight the potential of community and partnerships towards a brighter, more resilient and sustainable future for all. From the people of Asia and the Pacific, thank you JFPR and ADB, and thank you, the people of Japan. <laughs>